Hey guys, welcome back to Railroad Tycoon 3 Coast to Coast. This scenario is called the Third Republic. The fall of Paris at the end of Franco-Prussian War in 1871 also ended the reign of Napoleon III and the start of the Third Republic. France has seen its power waning in Europe along with the slow death of its aristocrat aristocracy, I think, aristocracy, and monarchy. Already overburdened, the new government turns to you to show the people that this new republic is in capable hands. Bronze, have company book value of 10 million by the end of 1896. Silver, have a company book value of 15 million and have 2 million in industry profits by the end of 1896. And gold, have a company book value of 25 million, industry profits of 5 million, and have the highest personal net worth of all tycoons by the end of 1896. Highest personal net worth. People knows I'm not good with that one. You may not start multiple companies, and you may not merge with other companies. So we gotta make sure nobody connects with us. Okay, then. There's Paris right there. Is there an Eiffel Tower? Can we see the Eiffel Tower? The Eiffel Tower may not be up yet. This is 1871, after all. And I don't rightly know when the Eiffel Tower went up. Anyway, let's start our new company. Uh, four quarters. No, we're not going to be four quarters. We're going to be... Hmm, what's a good French thing? Well, I was just talking about the Eiffel Tower, so we'll call ourselves the Eiffel. I probably misspelled that. You know what, we'll just call ourselves the Perry Perry. Express. a good Perry symbol. It's not bad. Ooh, let's call ourselves, uh, Oops. The flying hogs. Flying hogs. And we'll go with that one. Okay. Flying hogs. Set up shop. Now let's uh, turn ourselves right here. There we go. Okay. So there's Great Britain. Here's Free, and I think that down here is Spain and Italy and whatnot. So, where's our industries at? Alcohol all over the place. Okay. There's a bit of alcohol here. And where's our grain at? Ah, oh. so I bet you anything, this is a brewery. Yep, 1.6 mil, we can buy that. Buy ourselves a, a, a issue stuck. A brewery. It's gonna be uber successful. Probably another. Oh no, that's a bakery. 
and that's a bakery so we don't really have any competition here for all this grain and alcohol is wanted so that's that's a good thing we just did right there uh, weapons okay ammunition iron There's a little bit of iron down here meat uh, okay but where's livestock at livestock is kind of split this one though is probably going to be the most profitable one it's already 2.1 mil produce a little bit of produce over here on the coast Going to that distillery. Clothing, nope. Um, and no wool and no cotton. Lots of milk. Pulpwood. Where's our logs at? Or here. Good place. Yeah. It's the best place right here. And you're probably already, you know, logs and lumber. Okay. Oil, lumber, pulpwood. Hmm. The pulpwood's trying to go that way. Okay. Ooh, steel. Steel is desired, but there's no coal. There's two ports down here supplying coal. Oh, and there's a little bit of coal up here. And iron. Iron is way down here, trying to make it up there. Uh huh. Well. Now that we have our industry sorted. Where do we not want them to take? There's something to be set up here about these three big cities. Can we build unconnected track? Yes, we can. However, that may lead ourselves to being merged with. But we'll see. We're going to need to issue more stock. Some here in three. I think Ruin's a good city. It's got some grain up here. Uh, short Chartez. And of course, we got to get Orlean. Okay. Lay one thousand dollars worth of track. In tours. There we go. Our cities. Now we just need this brewery to be extremely successful. 
let's go. A new company over here. Mons to Angers. Americans are quite enthusiastic about France's liberty movement. Several American investors wish to help out by providing inexpensive coal, thereby lowering your fuel costs by 45%. However, this will anger the merchants from Britain, uh oh, from whom you not only get some coal, but engine parts. This will increase the cost of locomotives by 25%. What will you do? Well, theoretically, it would be better to get the lower fuel costs because our trains will always be needing fuel and will only buy relatively a few trains. So based solely off of this, I think we'll go with it and hope the Britain doesn't declare war on us or something. And there's another business just sprang up. Angers to Nantes. And there's another business. That place to that place. Company book value is one and a half. Industry profit is 418,000. Personal net worth is 138,000. And we're not the richest tycoon. Who's richer? So we're at 139,000. You're at 199. You're at 168. <laughs> So 191. Shoot a little bit more stock. And another bond. And another bond. And an upgrade. And then where did we say? Hmm. Might be better to go with this. Two and a half million. Let's pay off this 13 percenter.
$50,000. Well, we don't even have a train yet, so... We probably best get a train to go on. Very pleased. Yes. We're the, we're the highest tycoon. Awesome. Okay, let's uh, build our station here. Build a station here in Tours. How much do trains cost? 175, 125. You know what, I think, at least to begin with here, we're going to go with uh, Farley. And since as he don't ever lose a whole lot of steam, we can wrap him all the way out with a caboose. And go. He's not the fastest thing in town. But he gets the job done. Alcohol, 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 alcohol. 129,000, there we go. Okay, let's build you a service tower. Stock split two for one. Excited about our performance. We're the biggest tycoon. We've already met uh, industry profits for silver. Have a ways to go yet on our company book value though. How come I can't buy stock? I don't get that. Well, a duke! You, sir. You, sir. Will become a duke. Love dudes. Okay. Now let's have a line come out this way. And we'll have a line come from Chartez. Connect up. I'll have a line from Paris. Come out. Connect up. I'll have a line from Rouen. And I have 
enough money. Money, please. More money. Come on. 150,000. Uh, almost. A bit more. 180. 261. There we go. Now we just need 97,000 more. 63. 127. There we go. Lion Hawks split again. Oh, now we can buy shares. We just can't use margin, huh? What's wrong with our frames per second? There. Now we just need a lot of money. And our frames to be better. So our frames per second is really sucking right now. Like, really. As you guys, I'm sure, can tell. Hang on just a second. Let me, let me see what's going on. Okay, guys, we're back. Uh, I went and defragmented my hard drive, so we should work properly again. Uh, I was in desperate need of that. Seems as the last time that I performed a disc defrag is uh, right after I made like the first Farming Simulator 2013 video. So just trying to remember exactly uh, what uh, what's going on here. So we have a brewery here, and I remember our company is Hogs Can Fly or something like that. And holy mackerel. That is like the highest spike of any commodity I think I've ever seen. Probably build another brewery in Paris. And still never run out. Okay, and what, uh, So we're the richest tycoon, and we've already made industry profit, so now we just got to make sure that we keep the highest personal net worth and get this up to 25 million. 
and we only have one train and we have a million dollars so let's uh Build some trains, some dukes. Oh, we need stations. Okay, so we have one tours to Orleans, and we need one here. One here, and one here. Okay, and then let's build a duke from Orlean to Chartez. One to four. And one from Orlean to Ruin. And one from Orlean to Paris. And now, hopefully, we'll uh, start attracting that uh, start attracting the The thing I'm a bobber for hauling the most stuff. By this gate too. And then in just a second we'll upgrade this guy. And hopefully he will start grabbing all the grain. Or at least some of the grain. This guy here. <laughs> yeah. I don't think he'll ever in all his life run out of grain.
should probably double track our main line. At least along here. We are Mr. Bloke Rider. I don't know if I want to pay three and a half mil for a paper mill. Well, that kind of ruins all sorts of plans. That's fifty million dollars to dig in over there. How's our brewery up here doing? Not well. Although I think he will start to pick up because you can see he's at least started to attract those three. Yeah, he's doing all right. There's a brewery it looked like up here. You know, that's just stockpiling at a granary. Whoops, we don't need double track fill. Whoops, we don't need double track fill. Let's go ahead and connect these up. Uh, 
do that last bit. Not this way around. Down here through Amens, or however you say that. Come on, there's got to be some way. Make this connect. Thank you. Even though there's seven there. Okay, and then we'll have the Duke run from Ruin to Amen to Lil. to Brussels. And I think he'll be a big guy. Just have him work on the northern end up here. So he's going to haul mail the passengers and meet to Amen.
and he's going to haul milk and meat to Lil. And then he'll probably drop it off and pick it right back up and haul it to Brussels. Nope, he's carrying mail and alcohol. To Russell's. Having a little bit of lag here. Hopefully, it'll fix itself out soon. Need to repair you some of these bonds. Come on, frames. Our frames are totally sucking again. What the hell? Be back in a second, guys. Okay, hopefully this time. I really don't know what's up with our frames right now. I mean, this is a really old game. Well, not, I mean, really old, but older. My computer should be able to run it, I mean, in its sleep, beyond in its sleep. But anyway, we've got a lot of grain here. But we're starting to push our demand for alcohol way out here. But most of this out here is that $50 million place. So I don't know if it's worth going all the way out there. How are we doing? 11 million.
There's some ports down here in Marseille, though. So maybe we'll connect Marseille to Nimes to Lyon to Lucuserit, or however you say that. To Troy, perhaps? So let's build a line. Comes out this way. Keeps coming out this way. There we go. Maybe we'll go through Dijon. Well, that's really rough territory out there, I guess. Oh, uh, yeah. Then we'll just build a spur. Maybe we won't go to go to Dijon. to make a stop here in Lion. factory near Brussels. That's not where the lumber is. So we mainly just gotta get our company book value up.
all some more alcohol out. And then once he gets out there, we'll build another duke. Let's connect up those two. Can haul one thing and lumber out. Huh? Hopefully, we'll find something to haul back then. Passengers back. So we'll step on a time accelerator here. It's going to cost a bit to connect these two. Unless it looks like there's a valley, right? down this way. We could run a track down. Just like that. And then from there we could build a bridge. To over here. this side of the river. I have a spur that comes off through here. And another spur. Good night. Maybe. We build a really big station. Build a really big station. We can connect to it. No. There we go. We connect we can connect lion right here. build a station here, connect the zone, and a maintenance facility, and build a duke, to run between those two.
build another duke. Run between these two. can build a really long bridge, hopefully, really long bridge. bad numbers, but it is what it is, right? Step across the river here. Into Nim. And step back across the river. Sale. Build a mechanic and shop. Tower. Another tower. And another tower. train depot, a large train depot so you can get ports, come on, there we go. I think we'll build another maintenance shed out here, or not. Whoops. Now we need some money. How are we doing? 18 mil. Build a train to run from, whoops, not from there, from Lion to Nims. He's got a long ways to go. And then build another train to run between these two. quite have money yet. There we go. Okay, where's this guy? There he goes. Come on. It's all an ass. I can't even click on him. Slow down, you. My goodness. Look at him go. You, sir, thank you. Just flying along there. Oh, 
of Lumber Inn. And you're going to haul passengers, mail, and clothing, and coal out. Do we have any? Yeah, let's finish taking care of our outstanding bonds. There we go, no more bonds. Now, with any luck, we'll have what we need to win gold. So, let's step on a time accelerator. Our stocks are about to split. Almost have gold in the company book value. So we should be able to get the rest of it just by accumulating wealth.
Okay, let's uh, turn the dividend down a little bit. Come on. Look at there. Two fifty. Thank you. I really think we got this one in the bag. Pretty sure we do. There we go, guys. So, I will see you next time on the next scenario. Till then, this is Night Angel Marine.